welcome to this the last game we are having live today round two of the 64 man competition we are at tickles and jiggles Shawatule, kampala the venue is along the kampala northern bypass players on table are joseph luanyaga taking on caesar chandiga they are racing to five with penalties in case of four four for a place in the round of last 16. it is the first frame joseph zero caesar zero in the meantime joseph Fulanyaga is coming from mukono district the district which directly neighbors kampala but pretty much about a 20 minutes drive from the venue one of the best players there he is nicknamed madlala by the way takes the nickname of his idol from southern africa also called madlala once again they are racing to five but in case of four four we shall have penalties first frame of the match lag was won by joseph zero zero this will most likely be the last tournament you are seeing caesar participating in, in on ugandan soil for at least three months if not more because he should be leaving for south africa next week and we shall be seeing most likely more and more of joseph caesar is snookered and has fouled advantage joseph caesar's management team were actually suggesting a postponement of this match to tomorrow though before their suggestion could be considered the player came on table and that is how we are having this match there are other big games going on Sagawa Charles is taking on Ian Kazue big one results from that one coming a few players through to the round of last 16 the first one was Rashid Wagaba Dog City who has just defeated Katere Gabo by the way also coming next but not live Habib Sebuguzi and Mark Mochibi Caesar seems to be not in fear of taking risks in this game I know he probably knows Joseph he is a good player he has won one weekly comp that one happened sometime last year in Mokono at Black Sheep Arena and on that day he defeated Wanika Mansur in the final. So Caesar is having competition. Big shot needed here drawing the white ball in side motion. He instead goes for the drawback, a big drawback, a very effective fight drawn backwards. And an equally good shot to have a good white for the black this one more likely that don't you will be sinking it in yes he does caesar one joseph zero those are the fans of caesar shouting his name winning one game they are counting from 41 to 40.
change of tactics here as Joseph Ranyaka breaks white ball off cushion. He almost fouled because only one ball crossed the center of the table. Luckily enough for him, the ball ended up in the center pocket. Had he not potted that ball, it would have been a foul break. So his idea is clearly not to open the game, Joseph Luanyaga. And it's the right idea. He knows it is his best chance to try and beat Caesar. Very good shooting. The idea was to conclude day one of this tournament at 10 p.m. East African time. It is 9.29. We are pretty much on track. On some of the tables, we are having the last games of the day. And maybe each table, some of them, we shall, we shall have one, one more. The umpire is Mr. Henry Juko. It has been a long while since Joseph Ruanyaga was seen participating in, in an open comp like this one. He was a very busy player uh, past six months ago, but for the last half a year, he has not been so active. He has been playing in non-open comps, which are happening in his home district of Mokono. So those of you who have not been watching for quite a long time may probably not know him. It doesn't take anything away from me. He's, him, he's a decent player. He has defeated Joseph Kasozi twice before. He has defeated Mansur in a weekly comp final. In fact, when he paid money to, to register for this tournament, he requested that he is first against Kasozi. Although he was not lucky enough in the draw, he is sponsored by James Mwere of MJ Safaris Uganda a Limited, a tour and travel company. Jivat and Jr. asking at which stage this one is. It is this round of last 32. Same question from Tekos Na Kanipo. Round of last 32. And the same race. They are racing to five. But penalties in case of four. Four. It's a frame that Joseph decided to go defensive right from the word go. That is right from the break. Is Caesar trying a combination shot, putting both balls in the same pocket in the same shot? He tries it. It doesn't pay off though. Two shots. To Joseph is asking for the cue ball in hand and the umpire obliges. He uses his free shot to port and open up the game, which he does pretty well. Venue is tickles and jiggles Kampala. Majority of fans are clearly Caesar fans. Emma, I 
mean Cole wants to talk to you. Well, it seems the fans of the Scorpion are overwhelmed by the game. And it gives the opponent of Caesar a time. Well, let's see what he makes of that shot. He's trying to go for the center pot. There is a possibility that he might have snook at himself, but he's seeing the red ball that is next to the black slightly. And it's a foul. Let's see if Caesar can make this 2 0. And the cue ball is in Caesar's hand. Well, it seems we have the second. Let's see, he's taking the right pocket down there, and he puts it, that makes it two. The fans are so excited, and it's the season name that is all over the venue. Well, it's Caesar's break. Let's see if he can make it 3 0. It looks as though the fans of Caesar have made Madlala lose home by their relations. Let's see if he can throw something in this game. Well, Caesar breaks and the red ball is in. Let's see if he can make an apple here. Takes his time to decide. And the table is closed and red. Well, there is a possibility that this will be an apple for the Scorpio. Let's see how it goes. Fans are so excited. They are singing. They want another one, just like the other one. The song that most of you, I believe, know. That's a very good shot that he makes. Let's see how this goes. And he puts it. Well, this is an apple. It looks to be an apple for the Scorpio. And yes, the Mexican fans are so excited. The fans are so excited and it's Caesar's name all over the venue. It's 3 0. Well, this is Madlala's break. Let's hope for the best from him. Madlala seems to be tensed up, but let's see what he tries to break in a safe way. Let's see what Caesar can make of this. 
Oh, look like Caesar trying to open the balls that are near the block. Let's see the attempt that he tries to make here. And he tries to open the balls. Well, it seems he wants to go for the game to make it 4-0. Let's see what the Scorpion has to make. Wow, it was an amazing shot just that one of the red balls seems to be in a bad position but as the scorpion is, he stings where you never expect him to sting from and he's going for a double and he puts it, that's a very nice double and he's seeing all his balls, let's see the plan that he has call him the cue ball doctor as he tries to manage to calculate where he wants his way to be for the next shot and he tries to get it well it seems he's not seeing the ball but i believe he will try to spin to put that red ball into the right pocket that is over here the umpire is confirming if there is a snooker and the umpire grants a cushion play because it's a snooker and Caesar misses well tried the fans have it in mind that it's a win for Caesar. But his opponent is trying all the time to catch up. Let's see how the game goes. Well, he's trying to play a technical game so that he can get a chance to make it 3 1. Let's see how the game goes. Joseph is trying all he can to catch up with the game. I believe he will gain hope when he closes in to make it 3 1. Let's see if he can make it 3 1. But he looks to be having two balls that are not in a good position. But as pool is white, it's the ball that we have to focus our minds on. Anything can happen. Well, well played. I think he may try to give a snooker or he's planning to go for the whole game. Well, Looks like he's going for a snooker. That's what he's going for. Well, it's a snooker. Let's see what Caesar can make. Black snooker. He tries to spin. 
it's and that's a magical shot yeah. just like you missed it it was an amazing shot and the fans of the scorpion are so excited about the shot despite the fact that it was important well let's see what matlala can do like he's trying to set that ball so that Caesar doesn't have a way through that pocket and the fans have resumed to sing the song that they want another one just like the other one Caesar tries to put the red ball but it unfortunately fails to get into the pocket. Let's see how Jose can try to fit into that. Well, it looks as though he didn't play the shot that he expected. Caesar is trying to calculate, figure out where to put the black box. Well, pool without spectators, pool without spectators, sorry about that, pool without spectators might actually lose a fan. That's why Caesar's fans are giving him all the morale so as he can do his best. And he goes no pocket and he misses it. Let's see if Madlala can draw in to make it 3-1. Could he be going for the game or he wants to give Caesar a snooker? Yes, give him a snooker. Let's see the shot that Caesar plans to make. Off the cushion, but fails to put it. Well, I think this is the time and chance that Jose has to make it 3-1. It looks like he's going for the game. It looks like he's going for the game. Hold down the pressure. He has to take his time. Oh, and he misses it. Well, it seems this game is done, and Caesar is most likely to make it 4 0. And the plug is inside. Well, Caesar needs. Well, Caesar needs one game to go, but Matlala has to fight so that he can at least do something about the game. Otherwise, the game was in his hands, but the shot that he made denied him the game. Because it unfortunately Well, let's see what season makes of this break. Are we expecting another apple? It's a fair break. And let's see. Caesar doing his magic here. Wow. He tries to put to close.
across the table and the pocket denied him the chance to get the red balls. Let's see if Jose can close the table and go for the game. Although he looks to be frightened. Well, he closes the table and it looks as though he can make it for one. But let's see how the game goes. Goes for that push on ball and he misses. Well, a chance given to Caesar might be lethal because it looks as though he plans to get rid of this game. Let's see how he does it. It looks like Caesar is going for the game and the fans anticipate a 5 nil win. The fans are so excited. Well, he makes that drop back and gets the white. Oh, unfortunately, he misses. Let's see what Matlala can make of the chance that he has been given. Well, if such a player gives you enormous chances, it would be prudent of you to utilize them. Let's see what Madlala can make. Well, he gives him another snooker, and it looks as though Caesar is going for the center shot. Well, not a bad shot, but it seems he's going for the cushion ball up to this spot here. And he tried his best, although the ball sets itself at the lower right pocket. Well, Malala seems to be going for a connection. Let's hope it all works out because this is the only chance he seems to have. And yes, the connection was. Luckily, fails to put the white ball. Let's see what he plans to do. Can he make it for one? Or it will be a 5 0 win for the Scorpio? The fans of the Scorpion are having fun and the whole venue is astonished at how they are celebrating the win of the Scorpion. And what's Let's see what Caesar will make of this shot. It seems to be a tricky shot, and all eyes are on that shot. The umpire, but he seems to be going for a double, which we are waiting to see. See what he makes of the double, and it was a good shot, although it didn't enter the left bottom pocket. 
let's see what Maldulala can do about the chance that he's been given. I think this is the only chance he has to make it for one. Well, yes, it looks as though Maldulala will make it for one. Let's see what we can do. Well, precisely, he puts that yellow ball into the center court. Well, it looks as though he's going for the center balls and he's most likely to put them into all the center pockets. Right center pocket, left center pocket, and black finally in the right center pocket. Well played by Jose and yes, he puts it and makes it 4-1. And yes, it's 4-1. Let's see what he will make. The break that he will have. Well, Madala has got a token of appreciation from one of the spectators. I believe the spectator was excited about the shots that he played. Well, could that be a foul? The umpire says it's not a foul. The second red ball across the center. Well, it seems to be a defensive game for Matlala and Caesar closes the table. Well played and all the balls are in space. Well, the shot he made was quite good, although he hasn't got the perfect weight that he wanted, and he misses. Let's see what Joseph can do about this game. Could he make it 4-2? Or it will be Caesar's game to make it 5-1. Well, we are live at Tikos and Tikos Bar Chiwatule, a suburb in Kampala, and this is the beginning of your tournament. He attempts to go for the center pocket to A6. Caesar's going for the game. It looks like Caesar's going for the game, but it seems he hasn't got the weight that he wanted. He's trying to go for plan B. Let's see what he has. Well played. Well played. Such a hilarious shot. And the game seems to be coming to fruition. And he misses. 
well, Jose has been given yet another chance. What can he do about it? What can he do about it? Can he make it auto or he will give the game to Caesar? Well, he goes for the shot and he gets a good wide. We have a direct ball into the center pocket and it seems that's the shot that he's going for. Well done. Well, it looks like this will be a win for Jose, the youngster. that yellow ball although it's a bit far but it's still not inconvenient with this play and this is what well Caesar is seeing a portion of that red ball let's see what he plans to do played a very good shot and I think it will be very very hard for Jose to do something about that well is the frozen ball or it's not and the umpire says it's not frozen well Caesar is trying to force the young star the youngster is trying to do his best let's see what he can do attempts to go for the lower the, the far right pocket and it fails to turn out to be good. Well, it looks as though the game is done. Let's see the white that the scorpion will try to give us for the plan. Would it be going for a double or it will spin the black ball into the far right pocket? It looks as though he's taking it down. And yes, he does. 5-1 it is. Caesar. Exit to the next round. Well, I sign out and have a wonderful tournament as we get to the next round. Well, the fans of Caesar are so excited. So excited. It looks as though they are waiting for Caesar to win the whole tournament. Let's see how the tournament goes and from me, nice time.